Likewise, other files Outlook Offline OST file is also prone to corruption. The OST gets inaccessible or shows errors due to these points. Storage device failure. Network failure during OST synchronization. Sudden power failure. Virus attack or due to improper Outlook shutdown. This video gives a swift solution to repair and convert inaccessible or corrupt Outlook Offline OST file into PST file format. Let's check the best solution to convert OST to PST. DRS OST to PST file converter software repairs inaccessible or damaged OST file and then save it to PST file, so that you can instantly access the lost emails back in MS Outlook again. You can also save recovered OST emails in different formats like MSG, MBOX, EML, Text, DOC, etc. to open them outside the MS Outlook. You can also repair multiple OST files at once and export them to Gmail, Yahoo, AOL, Hotmail, Office 365, and various other emailing platforms. Now let's check out the notable features of the software. Open corrupt OST file and then converts it to PST. Also converts OST files to MBOX, PDF, HTML, EML, and many other file formats. It offers to import OST file to Office 365, Gmail, Yahoo, IMAP, AOL, etc. email clients. It supports all offline OSD files. Runs on all the versions of the Windows operating system. For better results launch the tool as run as administrator. Now understand how to convert OST to PSD file with DRS OST to PST tool. The software opens with a user-friendly GUI choose an option from a single file or multiple files. Now click the browse button to locate OSD files from your computer. Now select the OSD files and hit the open button to add them to the software. After that provide the log file and temporary file path. Click next to continue. From the next screen choose the OSD items you want to convert and click next to proceed. After that select the file saving option from the drop down list. Here we choose PST to complete the process. Now you can apply multiple customized features and filters as per your need. If you want to remove duplicate emails then tick the checkbox remove duplicate emails. Select the Maintain Folder Hierarchy feature to keep data in a structured form. If you want to save emails from a specific date range then tick the checkbox Mail Filter and Task Filter option, Enter Start and End Date as parameters. And you can also add a custom folder name for your choice. After that choose the File Saving Path and click Open to select it. Then, click on the Convert button to start the conversion process. Now the OST to PST file conversion process is running on your computer. Wait for some time until the process gets performed. After the completion of the process, you can download the status report or choose to convert again. If not then exit and close the application. Thank you for watching the video for more updates subscribe to the channel. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn.